Hello, how goes it guys? How goes it? I think I'm gonna try this fake British slang quiz and see how I do. Personally, I think I'm gonna be terrible at it because I'm not very well traveled. So <laughs> we'll, we'll see how we see how we get on, but I'll give it a whirl. Right, so this is fake British slang quiz. I think this is the first one. I am gonna be awful at this, so please bear with. Got a British guy in the office, we and do. he spouts off all the time using words and language that I'm just not familiar with. Gavin, would you mind? Hello, Aries. How you doing? Really. I think so it's on the drive. I'll check it out then, Angel. Thank you. Perfect. <laughs> just like that. Uh, so I'm glad that we brought Gavin free on set today. So there's a lot of British words that we don't know that this guy makes up. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they're not real. He's going to give us a couple rounds of. He's three British words. through and through. That guy at the back, isn't he? Yep. <laughs> Two of which are real, and one of which he's made up entirely. And it's up to us to figure out, independently, which one he's made up. And then we'll have a little British celebration at the end for right. all three of us. For having learned something. Mar my toast. Every day is a school but, day. Uh, you know, if, if, if you really suck at the game, we might, we might hit you with something a little extra. But we'll see. Okay, Gav, uh, you've got scran. Scran? You've got yonks. Dude! And you've got bleef. I've only heard of scran. <laughs> Two of those are real. Yonks is like people from somewhere. There's yeah. some British city, you know, like Yonks like, bleef. Like Indian American. Bleef. bleef is real. What the hell is bleef? <laughs> bleef, I think he's into. <laughs> that's like that's like bleef. when you really trust in something, you have 100% bleef in I it. I have full bleef. No, bleef sounds more to me. Like yeah, I'm saying bleef is the 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 fake there. Maybe? Question mark. On the and, you know, like, Damn that drug though. Proper yeah, tankard right like there. The e <laughs> scran is 100% because I say right. scran all the time. Trip over a little bleef. Uh, there's just a lot of bleef on the floor. Yeah. Okay. All right. Give me, hit me up with scran. What's scran mean? Maybe use it in food. a or definition or something. Uh, when you're munching food. on food. Scran. Let's go get some scran. Scratch yeah. Food. Can, Generic food. I can feel that. Yep. You ready? I'll do the countdown. Oh god, hold on. <laughs> Three, two, one, C. We both I, think okay. it's bleep. We I, both I, think bleep. I is think that as well. Yeah. All right. Food. Okay. Food. A really long time. Really oh, long yonks, time. of course, yeah. 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 So it's like another way of seeing years. This is, you know what I'm going to struggle with with this? And this one is utter bullshit. Is yes! seeing oh, it okay. written Why down? Because I'd never bad. write oh, yonks on a text yeah, or whatever. Yeah. But if I was talking <laughs> in conversation, I'd be like, oh, it's taking yonks. And I can feel Do you know what I mean? Got leaf in there. So it's kind of yeah. like. Yeah. Okay. But I got it right. No, so there's one for me. You've got Omel. <laughs> you've got Butty. And you've got Wazik. Wazik. <laughs> Omel, right. Butty, and Wazik. What strikes me as Gavin is Buddy. Strictly <laughs> because it ends with that E sound he loves so much, and it also centers on what I would consider his primary anatomy focus, the anus. Uh, <laughs> that is not what a butty is. Like butty that is not a butter. But be like, what, what was the, pronounced the last one again? Wazik. Wazik. That's one. <laughs> He's saying it confidently, even it's though it's not a word. Omel ain't one. Omel. <laughs> Almost an omelet. You're gonna get some eggs in the morning. Yeah. Let's go out for some French toast and an omel. Omel ain't a word, right? Omel. No, omel ain't a word. He can't even it, even hearing him say <laughs> butter <laughs> makes it not sound like a butter. <laughs> when he says it, it sounds like he's saying buddy, like a buddy, like a friend. But a butter is a sandwich. Wazik. Oh, Wazik yeah, is a bit of a pillock in it. Like, yeah, yeah. Went well Wazik the other day. No, like, you wouldn't not say it in that context, though, right? Nuts. He just was. You're a Wazik, Jeremy. You're a Wazik, <laughs> You're a Wazik Jeremy. You need a of one of these. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> with, um, you want I, a bit of Wazik in there? Let's get a little. Let's, waz. What's a Wazik, Gav? A Wazik is just straight up an idiot. I was yeah, yeah. Pillock. He's like, yeah. Oh, you Wazik. Like the venom he said it with. But I don't know what Omel is. And he could. What? I don't know. All right, I think I'm ready to get my answer. Gavin's super British. His favorite football is Tottenham. Three, two, one, B. We got C and a B. I went with Wazik. I'm going with Buddy. They thought Buddy was not a word. Idiot. Busted sandwich. Oh, Omel. Omel is a complete nonsense. No, <laughs> How did they not get that right? <laughs> <laughs> but I, you could have 
you can have like a sausage butty. Usually it's just like oh, he's a posh Brit. He, butty. Like butty. Anything. There, we, you see his accent really come out then, but uh, that just makes me think of um, Omegle. Do you know what Omegle is? Uh, we are watching a fake British slang quiz, Louis. So he's going to write three words. Two of them are correct British slang terms and one of them is a fake. It's an imposter. He talks proper, he does. Chip butter. See, nailed it, Mick. On the blob, that's on your period. On the blob is on your period. So that's one. What was the others? Phrases. Do you want me to go into the phrases? Yeah. Oh, wow, they really are. For example, okay. yep, she's ahead. on the blob. Yeah. She ordered the rag salad. She's got the painters in. Rag salad is wrong. Okay, on the blob might be might be drinking. You've been drinking, you're a bit on the blob. I think I've heard all No, the listen to the word blob. Is it, is it How blob can blob so be drinking? Like no, it's definitely something. It, it's just someone looks haggard. Someone looks not good. They <laughs> rag look salad. Rag salad. I mean, oh, rag salad like, might be right, but I've never heard she of it. Ordered a rag salad. So you're saying like she ordered just a real, real dog's dinner of a. Yeah, yeah. just a real bleefy. Meal. <laughs> Could I interest you in a definition? I'm but I've heard of painters in. Maybe be, but likely see. Got the painters in. We can go with painters in. What's painters you in? Gotta define that. Painters in means she's on her period. <laughs> oh, all right, okay, okay. So if that's the fake one, I'm gonna be shook. If rag salad oh, is so correct, believable. I'm <laughs> shook. Less believable. We can't neglect it. Because it's the thing there. is, I know if something is not quite right. I couldn't stop laughing at rag salad. I have never heard rag salad in my life, Angel. If this is real, literally on top of that. I've heard of the painters in though. I'm All right. You ready? Three, two, one, A. All right, I went with on the blob. Yep. Trevor went with rag salad. Going with it. This means she's on her period. No! No! My my going thing. Oh was, wait, they were all. You said rag salad. Yeah, but they right. Were all on period. This one is the fake one. Yay! <laughs> rag salad. I'm gonna start using that. <laughs> yes. Do in. Be proud. I don't understand any words. So for this video, I apologize, Lewis. That's why I was sold on it. I was really. I've really heard of being on the rag. Whenever rag salad, it's same Mick. Same. Be right back, game. Like rag salad. Sorry, guys. I'm on the rag salad. <laughs> Did he have to cup his hand then like that? I'm shook. We've got skew whip. We've got sheet meat. And we sheet meat. Okay, these are all sheet meat. The definition of what is a sheet meat? I'm gonna try a new tactic on this one. I'm gonna repeat them all back to him. I have a really bad feeling about what these mean. Skew whip. It's just a bit on the wonk. It's not straight. It's a bit skew whip. You know. But what sheet to me? What? I'm not getting much of it, but then again, I'm not savvy on brick culture. I already, I already have, so there's one that I'm very confident is actually one. I think we need a definition of skew whip. I just have nothing yeah, to go it's, on with it's that. Two, like, those two words never go together, so I'd yeah. love to hear it. Skew whip. Skew whip is exactly those words never go bit. together. Uh, you know, that, that painting's a bit skew whip. Why wouldn't uh, you just say it's skewed? Like, like or a skew, yeah. It's, it's a bit skew whiff, isn't it? A rag salad skewed with <laughs> <a> salad. <laughs> Oh no, you don't want to put a rag salad skew on. <laughs> this game is jokes. I want you to use one of these in a sentence. Ooh, you're adding in some. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, <laughs> let's do let's do batty crease. Or the girl might say, um, I want you to rub oil over me. Paying special attention to my breaths and my back crease. Okay, all right. I've never heard of back crease. I'll be honest. I've never heard of back crease, and I've never heard of sheet meat. I don't know. Maybe it's like. But surely B's wrong. Maybe. That's really good. At that point, I think I know my answer. All right, I'm. I I've got my dad. I do. All right, you count it down this time. B, I'm gonna say is the wrong one. One A. You are both wrong. I got it right. I got it right. Thank the Lord. But a batty crease. That and I ain't. That must be a London thing. That. Oh, it's your butt. Yeah. It's like the the area between the butt. Batty crease. That's rank. My definition of sheet meat was like. Do you guys say rank as well, or is that a British slang term? Like when so much rank. 
It's like not nice. It's fascinating seeing how confused my fellow Americans are by the British right. slang. You got Terry Phillips, you got Gordon Bennett, and you've got John Thomas. Okay. Gordon Bennett's one. Gordon Bennett. John Thomas is a thing. We know it. All right. It means, it means the guy's uh, parts. Right. Yeah. Okay. That's parts. John Thomas. Is there such a person as John Thomas? Did he exist at one point? I didn't know that. I'll be honest. <laughs> didn't know John Thomas was um. What's Terry Phillips mean? Terry Phillips is, is uh, a name that you would call someone in your group who is just really boring. Terry really Phillips. Terry. A is the wrong one, isn't it? A is the wrong oh, one. Coming over. Well, well, but I've never heard of John Thomas, but they well, seem to know what John Phillips Thomas did. was. He's so. the guy, he's the boring guy in the group. He's but Gordon guy. Bennett okay. is an easy one. And then can you it's basically like, God damn it. In a sentence. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Gordon Bennett. So it's like an Like, God damn it. Oh, oh, no, he does do that. You're like, oh, boy, oh, Gordon Bennett. And when he says yeah. Jeebus Lorenzo, it's the same thing. Jeebus Lorenzo. <laughs> This, Two, this one, is jokes. Penis. Hit me up. What is right. it? So, John Thomas. John Thomas is the penis. Yes. Got Never heard of John Terry Thomas Phillips being the penis. Is absolute bullshit. Yeah. Wait, you were the last <laughs> Oh, no, I need the ball. No, I need the. I need the ball. Uh, I say it in Australia, I think at least I do. Like, I so it's rank. Like, Bikery like, sounds like an ass crack sort of word. Yeah. Oh, I, I think Bikery like, reminds yeah, me of I Ali G. Like, oh, yeah, he was always. So, oh, he, yeah, yeah, Ali G used to say party all the time. So I, I wanted to, you wanted to pick the fake. Uh, when you find out what John Thomas is, you'll know why you've not heard it. Yeah, I've never heard of a John Thomas. Is it only lads that use that then, Tim? So you call your thing a John Thomas? Your man drunk? I don't know anyone who calls it <laughs> Tim's just sat all my. Oh. <laughs> me john thomas well i did enjoy that i did enjoy that so thank you and i believe there's a part two right yeah there is i've never seen these guys either these guys are called achievement hunter and it's um a massive channel two of them are real british slang one of them he made up completely all right all right well let's oh he looks stiff he looks better with a beard right Welcome back to the isms zone. You're gonna give us the terms we can use Chinese. Thank you, that abnormal person. Thank you for the follow. Thank you so much. We are currently doing a fake British slang quiz. Yes, we got. We've got Bagsy. We've got. Bagsy's one. Brolly's one. Three is wrong. Brolly's a Saiyan. Yeah, he is. He's a legendary Saiyan. Rimmer sounds like a sexual thing. So C is like completely a wrong. No, I don't think that that's the whole person. Cheers, thank you. I believe Bagsy and Rimmer. So, <laughs> Bagsy. Alright, let's see what you... Brawly. Brawly. It is uh, short for umbrella. No, come on. Yes, it is right. Indeed. Oh, it's raining outside. Oh, grab the brolly. Okay. Hey, Chuck is How can they laugh at a brawler? Give us a, ba a sentence with Bagsy. They don't say brolly in America? <laughs> I, I hate the way He's he just, just looked at She was Bagsy. Like, that's it. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Bagsy! <laughs> I mean, it's How can you not know what that means? Yeah. <laughs> Bagsy means like calling dibs on. Yes, it does, Mick. Nailed it. Sounds like a soap. No, so it's basically like if you want something and if you call it out, no one else can have it. So you'd be like, Bagsy on that. I have called dibs on it. I've got, I my, I've got my guess. I think, so, I think we're so, on the same page. One, two, three, two. Umbrella is an umbrella. Bagsy. Bagsy is fake. And I'm saying Brawly is fake. The umbrella. I hate to inform you, chaps. Three is fake. Dang it! <laughs> Come Dang on! It. No, Brawly, I believed totally. Like, I could see someone yeah. being like, the umbrella. Hey. Bagsy is like calling shotgun. So, oh, so if, if you see whoa. something that you want, it's like, oh, Bagsy, that. Oh, oh is, is it? Oh, because, dibs. Like, dibs. Like, yes, 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 yes. Yeah, yeah. Shotgun specifically for riding shotgun, but right. yeah, oh. it's like dibs. So, what was your definition? And I didn't get to use my fake yeah, definition. Yeah, let's hear it. Um, I hear it. Like I got a lot on my plate. Like uh, I'm having an absolute brimmer today. Oh, I kind of like that. It's up to the brim. He's yeah, quite good at coming up with stuff. Yeah, I'll give him that. that wholeheartedly. Yeah. I would have been like, yep. All right, I giggled it. <laughs> like, backseat. That's fine. <laughs> 
fucking duck in sight, mate. Or like he's Danny got, Dyer. Danny Dyer. <laughs> I could see him. Not a Boris. fucking duck in sight, yeah. mate. I would definitely say Broly. Yeah, he's like, well, I'll start writing outside, I'll whack a Broly out, and then after the park. <laughs> His impression of a cockney. Okay. You got Cornish flipper. Sana, yeah, flipper. that's one. And Bap is one. I don't know what number two is. I ain't sure what a Cornish flipper is. <laughs> Someone from a uh, down south flipping some um, pancakes, maybe. I've got nothing on Sarni. I've got no reads on Sarni. I need a deep read on Sarni. They've never heard of Sarni. This is blowing my mind. It's a sandwich. It's not even I'm not Google anything, just go with the flow. I've never heard on second word. No, I've never heard second word. Love a pair of paps in the morning. I bet you do. Yeah, it's, they, it's, write, they wrote Sammy and yeah, then broke and then, the R and then in the end. A little bit, yeah. <laughs> Maybe that's how they came up with it. Who knows how they make up words, you know? Sarni, like there's, there's no... Are they, are they faking like, this? Short Guys, if you are not British, <laughs> are you buying this? Sarni. I swear people know what a Sarni is. He's just going to yell he's, bap he's at us. He's just going to yell bap at us. <laughs> he's going to go bip, bap, bap. <laughs> It will be telling to hear Cornish flipper this time. Okay. I mean, bap, to be fair, has two different meanings. Some kind. Yeah. Because you can get like a, a chip bap. Cornish hen. Take a bite out of that. Or boobaloobalies are also baps. So. He's, either, he's laughing so much either because he made it up or it means something bad. I'm having so much fun with this. Lynn, hello. You were gifted a, a tier one sub, so enjoy, Lynn. I was made up <laughs> for you. Gavin, I mean, if it's a word. Baps has more than one meaning in British slang. Cobb. True, Sharon. Oh, I'm from Nottingham and we oh, use the yeah, word cob. No. Oh! Cob? It's a no from me, Mick. <laughs> to be fair, we don't really say bap either. We say balm. We say a chip balm. But I'm northern and he's southern. So, like, up north, it's a balm. Like a chip balm. God. Serious Show Fanatic, hello, hello. Three, two. They're not faking, I've watched the crew for years. This is blowing my mind, no prob rob. Yes. Did he get away with Cornish flippers? I, yes. I thought I'd make the made up one just completely mental on that one. Uh, that is yeah. the I've never heard of any of these beyond the little British TV we get here. This one was gonna be Madness, the word cob is such a, a riot for dispute and so many hate it. I, I'm not a fan of cob. <laughs> I've heard people say a cob salad right, as right. well. Yep. Cornish flipper. One to one. One to one. Round three, lads. Used to have a bacon right. bap. Crimbo. Not a bacon butter. Crimbo. Or a bacon bam. Bacon bap. Crimbo. Or a ham and cheese cob. Oh, I missed them then. I, have heard him say anything I also feel like prank sounds so familiar. Crimbo is true. That's just Christmas. Oh, no. Dilbert and prank. Oh, this is a hard one. Dilby is like a knockoff surround sound system. Dilby and Prang. <laughs> Prang is like a chip brand that you can fit Prang. in the, in the thing. Dilber. You can. <laughs> Dilber. I'm going to say C is wrong on this. This, this is the round this I have technique, to, I have to yeah. get in here. Right, Maybe. I'm not confident on this one. This one's a hard one. I don't know what a Dilby is. And I don't know what Prang is, but Prang sounds kind of right. But Crimbo is just Christmas, guys. Now here's what I need to get. Chip butter. <laughs> That's the only time we use butter. Chip butter. Bacon cob. Sausage cob. Cheese cob. This is killing me, Mick. <laughs> I need to teach you on British culture. This is embarrassing. This is this is your first lesson, Nando. Isn't it Dilbert a hat from the UK? Dilby hat. I've never heard of it. It's probably too posh for me, John, to be honest. It's come up again. I know it. Can you I do be a ruffian? Common as muck, so if that is indeed a hat, it must be a fancy one. Do you mean like a top hat or something? If Crimbo is Christmas, we got a problem. Dilber. There's no B in Christmas. Trilby. Trilby. Yeah, Trilby's a hat. Yeah, Trilby's a hat. What are we doing? So this series show fanatic is a British, fake British slang quiz. So he's going to list three words. Two of them are right and one of them is wrong so these guys on the left are americans and have no clue and the one on the right is british anyway and he's coming up with the fake words gut instinct just going ready yeah yeah all right one two three 
One. Oh. We both went prank. You did what? Dilbo? Prank is real. Dang it. Like you could say, oh, I pranked it. So I got it right. I don't know what Dilby is. It's my fake definition. Okay, it's what's Dilby? Dilby? Dang it. What is Dilby? You should have said it. I you knew. Went, wait, you, I knew you I lost thought you it. had it. Wait, you were nailing the reason I, I didn't even, subconsciously, I did Dilby because of all the reasons. You prank did. is yeah, being yeah, hit by Dilby. something. Dilby. Like prank your car. No, like dink it. Like you prank dink prank it. You know, it comes up yeah. with this is Never heard of that, Tim. So that must be, is that a southern thing then? And uh, this uh, was going to be a female contraceptive. Oh, I got a loose Dilby. I got a loose Dilby. Throw a wobbly. True. Tuppence. Number two is wrong. You can do that the NFL. Do you think drop the tuppence is Number two is definitely wrong. This is kind of getting easy, that this for me now. So. <laughs> Where I'm from, prank means to be scared of something or someone. I've never heard of prank before. Must be the lower half of the country used to hear prank a lot as a kid. Yeah, I've never heard prank. Oh, thank you for the redeemed hydrate, XZ. Clink and welcome. Okay. Yeah, drop the tuppence, definition. As a definition? Yes. It means. You blew your chances. What does tuppence mean? What is the word tuppence? Money. The thing? Tupperware? <laughs> tuppence. I mean, that's, yeah, I mean, like. Oh. And then I guess we want a sentence of throw the wobbly, right? Yeah. Throw a wobbly throw just throw means, wobbly. like, you have a bit of a well, tantrum. Well, but then Dave, throw a wobbly. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. We're just going to go over the guesses on this one. One, two, three, two. two. One point. For Jeremy. Oh, yeah. Oh, Nailed it. I thought Tuppence was real. Can you turn up the ball? I can indeed. What, oh, really? Like, it's like a ramming together of two peas. Oh, so, oh yeah, that was dropped. great. That's that was brilliant. What, that's why I walked away from it, but I should have gone oh, that's a little bit better. this definition didn't line up. Might be something. thing. Again. Oh, fuck's sake, I've pranked my car. Legit, never heard of that. JPB, thank you for the follow, my dude. Welcome, welcome. Oh, so someone's like rubbing yeah, yeah, wind your neck in is basically like, oh, just hike down, like, calm down a bit. Like, shut up. Throw a wobbly means that they threw a tantrum. Yeah, like an adult throwing attention. Like, oh, he threw a wobbly. I love, like, I'm so <laughs> on board with it, and then the more it describes it, I'm like, I hate yeah. this. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> throw a wobbly. The final round. The final round. Do -do 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 -do. Five. Billy Biscuits! Billy No Mates! Billy Bollocks! One is wrong. There is no <laughs> Billy Biscuits. Oh, Billy No Mates! <laughs> That's so insulting! Billy <laughs> oh, look no at Billy No Mates over here not hanging around with anyone. <laughs> I mean, that's right. Oh, You're biscuits. nailing it. Oh, they're they're thinking that they're making the men, a joke. Well, that's biscuits. exactly what so it means. Like, <laughs> cuts over this, like, round rump. Get your <laughs> neck in, is what I, I heard. Get, get your neck in. Get your really neck in. Is that when you be a noser? You can challenge him to anything. I could imagine get, get your neck in is a different... Billy Biscuits. I need Billy Biscuits. I don't know what that could be. What's the word? Billy like it just has a different meaning. Like get your neck friends. in is what I would imagine. Bollocks like you know when you're being nosy and you're like <laughs> peeking over or you're like <laughs> sick your nose somewhere it shouldn't. No and so wind your neck in is like no shut up. Like so please just stop so talking. That's not even clever. You're telling me Billy Biscuits is <laughs> not so true. That sounds so delicious. Never heard of Billy Biscuits. Okay and trusting. Now it means calm down. Do you what you're supposed to be doing. Like doing better at school, etc. Right? Okay, get your neck in. Is my favorite thing. Billy Big Bollocks, I that's what we say. No there should be a big in between that. Like Billy, Billy Big, Big Bollocks. Billy Dav loves saying biscuits about stuff. Yeah, he does. But I don't know if that means he made it up or biscuits came from somewhere. You know, I was saying biscuits. We're, we're down to another situation where I can't let him get away. I only with know Billy, Billy No Mates is real because of Austin <laughs> Powers. Oh, I'm saying, I can't let that Austin slide. Powers. Last yeah, round. baby. Yeah. One, two, three, two. one. Wow. I went Billy Biscuits. My other one was Bollocks. One was wrong. It's another point for Jeremy. Wow! Billy Biscuits! Biscuits. I was yes. way off this my, whole... My uh, oh. thought process there was like, you know, when you reach into your pocket, you got no money, it might just be crumbs. Like, hey, that's like, you got empty pockets. You got like pocket lint and biscuit <laughs> yeah. crumbs. What? Billy no mates. Billy no mates is real. You got, the, you, got the, you got it right? Well, yeah. yeah, someone has no friends. No friends, he's loner. Oh. <laughs> he's a loner, Billy no mates. Billy Bollocks is uh, naked. Let's well, take the win. Let's uh, head that back means, to set. Sure. All right. Right over here. Yeah. Just right there. I will gladly take the win on that one, even though there's no Marmite on set. Well, you know, while I was coming up with those, I accidentally came up with like three other sets. Well, I might have to be a third one. Might have to do another episode. Maybe yeah. next quarter. Well, again, enjoyed it, and I bloody smashed it, if I do say so myself. Let me just switch this really quick.
And here we go for part three of the fake British slang quiz. Have I got any wrong yet? Today, I don't think good. I have, have I? One fresh Gavino free. Oh, Freshly nice. unpacked. Hot off Four the a recession! Ah, oh, so the one you got wrong was in well, this one. everybody, yeah. Yeah, yeah this is the third iteration, and you've probably seen it from the title. It is the Gavinisms oh, or the British slang quiz. Oh, he looks good in that jumper. Uh, I'm that cooler. Yeah, I'm carry, I'm carry carry that you, little... you claimed he was top heavy I'm on the way in. Light. We get a definition? No, I love it. So what do these guys usually do? Are they always and, uh, quizzes and, and stuff? And a juice and a sentence? Those I've never heard of these guys. Those are the two. But I yeah. like okay. them. And, and there'll be only one word each. Five rounds. Five rounds. Ooh. All right, five rounds. Round rounder. one. Round one. What do you got for us? We got Binny. We got Dench. And we've got Miffed. Dame Judy Miffed Dench. Miffed is one. All smashed together in one beautiful and, word. Uh, and Dench, I'm going to say is one. So Binny. Binny's wrong. You're Miffed. I'm a bit Miffed. To be honest, Binny's good because it's like I'll just. I've never heard of Binny. Binny. Oh, Binny could be a bin. What's a what's a Binny? It's like pre-drinks, like before oh. you would go out to the pub. Where's the Binny? Have a Binny round mine. Oh, I'll, I'll have a listen. bin of vodka before we go out. <laughs> right. I might have this wrong, Binny. Binny. I'm gonna black out before I go. You know what I mean? Can you use Dench in a sentence and don't just yell Dench at me? Uh, pick you up at seven, Dench. So it's like, oh, I feel like I got oh, it wrong. Right. I'm, uh, obviously, like, I've like said my answer now, so I'm sticking yeah. with it. But Rod, this might be the one I get wrong, yes, Angel. Vinny, let me help you out here. Mm. But I've I never heard of Vinny. That it. must Bev's be a southern inside. thing. Let's go have Bev's inside before we go to the pubs. Bev's in. Yeah, so you oh. have some bins. I, I know what I'm voting for. I think I do too. Three, two, one, one. two. So you think Vinny is fake. I think Dench is fake. Why did I do that? Did you want to vote for this being fake? I do now. You are correct! Oh, oh I got it right! Yeah, Thank Benny's God. Bollocks. So, oh, yeah, Dench. I got it right. Yeah, people just started saying, I think, assume it came from Judy Dench. But I didn't know, I I didn't know the, de Judy the Dench, yeah. Dench yeah. Um, I, I used to have a friend. Terminology was, was that, that, to be honest. He wore, <laughs> was just he wore a shirt that just said Dench on it. He was a Billy No Mates. He was a Billy No Mates. Yeah, so it's, someone yeah I've never heard of Binner. Never heard of Dench. Yeah, Dench is, I think that's a sort of thing. It's on my desk. Round two. Round two. The theme is up. Oh, okay. We got tits up. We got knees up. We got heels up. Heels up is wrong. Tits up, knees up, heels right. up. If something's gone bad, it's, it's gone, gone tits, tits up. up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we know this from many a GTA. Many, many a GTA. See, for me, I would think heels up as if you fell. Yeah. Like if someone slipped, they went full on. They went full heels up. That's the definition of knees up. It's a party. Like, you probably wait. say, oh, like uh, you know. Jim's 30 this week. We'll go around this for a knees up. For a knees up? <laughs> like, you, it's a yeah. now? <laughs> I used tits up way too much. Save oh, your mind. Put your knees up. It's on, like, not even social an action. Gathering. They'll be drinking. I'm going to have a birthday knees up tomorrow. It'll be great. Yeah. It's going to be so good. That's what you I say. Love, I mean, you, you always sound English, but I love how, like, concentrated your English gets in these episodes. He, oh, yeah, you know, he surrounds context. it with other <laughs> He does sound right. posh though, doesn't he? Please use heels yeah. up in a sentence. Oh, he was running in the box there and he went heels up for no reason. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think it was it. Well, for no reason. It was like he decided to. Wait, he was he was running. What did you say? He was running in the box. That's a whole different thing. I don't He's, even know what that means. You <laughs> he sounds proper posh. He really does. Football. Okay. Ah, oh, he went heels up for no reason. So he like... He could have flopped? Flopped, yeah. Yeah. Binny was the fake one last time, and yeah. the definition was also to go around gyms to have a couple bevs. Knees up, we're heading back to gyms. We're going to gym. gyms. Gyms got a lot going on. <laughs> well, also you had a Binny before the knees up, That's right? True. Yeah. Could In fact, you could have a Binny while you knees up. <laughs> no, you can't. No, Binny's before. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Two. Three. Please. Point for Jeremy. Yeah. Oh, Nailed that it. was too weird to not be real. <laughs> He's up absolutely real. Yeah, yeah Dench has like, got to be a similar I feel like there's like a, a like weirdness Dench. spectrum. The closer to like normal it is, it's it's regular. And the weirder it gets, the the more normal it is. That's what I was but saying. But in the middle is this uncanny, well, it's more like <laughs> an uncanny valley of yeah. like slang. That's quite an old-fashioned one. I'm having to delve into the past. With the the knees, knees up. Yeah. Knees up's an old-fashioned so one. So it's Gavin's from Hillingdon. Only old people like say knees up. Maybe from up Middle Earth. Earth. Hillingdon. So if you put your feet up, Hillingdon. is that like kind of your knees up? Or is like, I think Dench is more modern. Younger people use it. Ah, I see. I see. I've never heard my sister say Dench, though. That's okay. And she do, she do be a youth. Hands. Losing everything, I'm losing my mind. The youth losing of today. <clears throat> okay, that's ready for you in the corner. Round you got three. For us? We've got on the pull. Yeah. Bunty Shuffler. And Hank Marvin. Two <laughs> is definitely wrong. <laughs> Hank Marvin means that you're starving. 
and on the pole you means you're trying to names. get it's your leg over. Line. Hank, and Hank Marvin. In the stupid amount of times we go, can you use or that? Or do you not say get your leg over either? Is that also a British terminology? It just means you want to. So what I'm going to say is. We uh, hook up ask with for someone. That in a sentence because that's happened every time. What I have a 15 year old daughter and never heard it. Use the word, I've never heard dance before. I love how you explain slang. We're slang, I'm sorry. I'm trying, I'm really. On the pole. I'm not very good at this. suspiciously close to just like on the pill. On the pill. Which is already like a. Or on the pole. If you're trying to get to college. Yeah. That was very funny. Thank you. This, Can we get this is an easy on one, yes, sure. Right. <laughs> Can we get on the pole They've in a sense? Gotta get this Going right. Out tonight, lads. Over at Jim's. Oh, are you heading to a knees up? A knees up at Jim? <laughs> bit of a bit even. I went for the penny. <laughs> on to the pole. <laughs> I want to know the definition of a good old Hank Marvin. Yeah. Yeah. yeah we're going to leave Absolutely starving. Right? I've got right. some, some gut feel. Starving hungry. Hungry. I haven't eaten all day and I'm real Hank Marvin. <laughs> He yeah. likes a lot of things. <laughs> I love when he puts it into a continents. sentence, this guy on the left. And that's what we really pulled out and of episode he, he one. he nails the sentence like every time. Of, but he thinks he's being funny. And it's like, no, that's what we of, say. Like, he likes, like, that, sir, that has that everything. That's everything Gavin would love. Like, there's a formula. I'm like, absolutely <laughs> Hank Marvin. And just, like, you should get your sister to watch this while she's there. And, like, I mean, I think like she'd find this hilarious, to be honest. And so, because of that, you're explaining it very well. I couldn't say it back to you if you asked. I haven't. Listen at all about the pole, and yeah. the rhyming Cockney slang is in there. On the pole, I'll yeah, try and I, teach you guys again, a few. It makes no sense. It's so is. weird that it it, it must right? be real, right? You'd hope. But they just call each other names. They're just like, oh, that guy's Frank Jeffrey. It means he's tired. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like, why? 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 Is that? Oh, I knew a guy named Jeff. He was just tired all the time. Right. Okay. I. Ugh. <laughs> I, I, you know what? I'm gonna go with Hank Marvin. Really? Yeah. I'm going with two. You're going with three? Two is wrong. Um, don't let it be one. I won't let you get away with that. Number two is fake. Oh, it was a Gavin formula. <laughs> I've, uh, I was slightly disappointed I didn't get to use my definition on oh, it. Oh, I would love to hear yeah, it. Yeah, please. Uh, my definition was gonna be just like people, solicitors going door to door. I'll, like, watch out for a couple of <laughs> bunty shufflers out there. Just like making the rounds. Don't go outside. The shuffling from door <laughs> I've got to give him props for his creativity. Your brain this would be a funny thing to say. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you just know. My, the, Josh you know, like, Ball, hello, how are you? Good to see your remotes brain. back in the, uh, in the chat. I don't even know if they're talking in English at this. Also, on the pole. Sorry, the doctor. You see the episode of Starving Marvin from South Park? That's a play on Hank Marvin. I love South Park. Great. I haven't fooled you yet. I've not got you to guess both the wrong ones. You've maybe, been close, though. Maybe this is the round. You've got Dosh. Money. You've got Wonga. And you've got Chut. I don't <laughs> know what is Chut one. is. This Chut. is the round where he gets both it's of us. It's three. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what said Chut Dosh is. To me before, but it was by accident when he Wonga. was trying to read me Morse code. Dot, dot, dash, I mean, dosh. I'm assuming <laughs> and Wonga is, is cash Just as well. End of sentence. Chut, is that anything to do with chutney? And what is chutney? <clears throat> A it's food? A, it's a food, but it's like a, isn't chutney like a mixture of a bunch like of stuff? Like a pickle. Yeah, you thing. get it in a jar. You put it on like mango chutney with a bit of Indian food or something. Yeah. Wonga. Wonga is something. Wonga's money, this right? Is, <laughs> this is the round. Thank you for the floor. hydrate bath oh, as well. Right. And welcome back. How are you doing today? The technique that's never worked. <laughs> It'll always never work. Dosh. Oh, dosh. <laughs> 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 Vader. Dosh Vader. Oh, I like a bit of Wonga. <laughs> Chut. Is Wonga money? That's all I got. Because I know Dosh is money. Chut, though, we got a little... His face I've had never like heard many of wires Chut. in many places that went... Like they wanted to move. Processing spots. Chut. What is a Wonga? Money. Yeah, How I thought about it. It's definitely three. for money can <laughs> exist. <laughs> a lot. Like you have a lot. Yeah, there I'm is a lot. trying to pull it together because there's... Dosh, Wonga, why, pennies, Burger. cash, There's all sorts of slang moolah, that makes sense. two pence, fiver, <coughs> tuppence, Wonga. monkey. Wonga. Okay, hold on, I haven't heard that one. But Wonga is just ridiculous. Wonga is just a sound. It's like there's words <laughs> and then sounds. It's like I got hit by two bats at the same time. Wonga. That's a real Wonga. <laughs> hit me with a Dosh sentence. Found a wallet on the floor. Filled with Dosh. dosh. They're all money? <laughs> no! No, they're all money. <laughs> I told you, they just, 
They can't just call it money. I don't like, <laughs> call it money. I love how angry he's uh, getting. Quid. They got quid. quid. Yeah, so that's Oh, yeah, quid as well, up. yeah. Shut in my way. You quit. That's gonna cost you a bit of chat. And Bob. You just, you come in That'll here, cost you a few Bob. That sounds so money. I'm all out of Wonga, my bud. Ooh, Wonga. Oh, is not I'm gonna go with two just world. because, world. because <laughs> Wonga's <laughs> definitely <laughs> real, right? Dosh, I can almost make the most sense out of it. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Dosh. All right. And I'm gonna go with Chuck. I could be wrong here. Mm. Point. <gasps> for Jeremy. Yeah, wow. it was Chuck. It was Chuck. Well done. Just Got it right. I've not lost one yet. You've Judging lost me there, LMAO. Round. Lost me. You got Bendles. <laughs> Straight over the edge. You got Skive, and you've got Lurgy. There's the E. One's There's wrong. The e sound. The Lurgy's got it. Like so Lurgy is when you get you sick. Like, a, a like oh, you just got the Lurgy. You don't want. You don't want to go near her. She's got Lurgy. And Skive means like skipping school yeah, or a, dodging a an event. You don't want to go to that. So I'm gonna Skive it. I don't know what Bendles is. So it's got to be one, right? Remember the payday loan company? Yeah. One go <laughs> yes, Sharon. Yes, yes, I remember that. Only 42 subs. If only it was a nice solid round 50. Josh. Josh. High society folk. I've got my eye on you. Ashley, hello, how are you doing? What are you watching? So, here we go. Skive sounds like something you mismatch skydive. No one in the UK is guy. <laughs> Seb, hello. How you and doing? Then Bendles welcome, is, welcome. Uh, just a word that he's made up. <laughs> Listen, I don't know if it's my brain slowly melting or if I'm getting worse as the rounds go on. I'm clueless. <laughs> All right. We, we are melting we his brain Bendles. with these shocking the British are typically terms. The uh, richest area in the place you live, like somewhere mm. you would have to pass by but you can't afford to live in. That's the where the, you might find a lurgy. That's the Bendles. It's where you Very might find a lurgy, probably not. Just around the river. We bendles. don't go down that way. I haven't got any clue about any of these. It's, it's all good, the ecstasy. The it's every day's a school <laughs> right, day, you know? Yeah, before we go to it's the Is she in the Europe British? Are you going to ask to French or German or something for the duration of this quiz? Jim's not coming out tonight. He's got the lurgy. So, like, he's short for laryngitis. Oh. <laughs> no, I don't know. <laughs> He's got the lurgy. Lurgy. Luggies. He's got to face the lurgy. Use both. He was out late last night on the pole. Right. And now he's right. now he's back from the knees up with a lurgy. He had a binny, went knees up, out on the pole, and then came back. Wasted oh, all thank his dogs. Too ill to go to work. He's on the lurgy or whatever. On the lurgy. He's got a lurgy. Three, two, one, two. two. Oh, we pulled it with Skive. Wow. Oh no. Skive is real. Oh, oh no! Oh. Was it was it the Bendles? It was the Bendles. Oh, I knew it. I made up the Bendles. I thought you were gonna go with Bendles. He's so I good at bringing it up, making up these words though. I knew oh. Lurgy was sick, but it also sounds like <laughs> no, something could like, grab yeah, someone back. Yeah, Scooties aren't real. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> oh, I went 750, so which I take pride since I'm not British. <laughs> you hot, you do deserve that pride, John. Very well played. Very well played indeed. I got 14 out of 15, same as Angel. The car is beat us both. I got zero out of fifteen. You can skive. I just feel like that's a series of letters. <laughs> so that was it. Is that all of it? Smashed together. Like yeah, that was it. Yeah. You know what? I freaking enjoyed that. Thank you, John. Big shout out to John for sharing that, and Liam for linking it up for me as well. Thank you so much, guys. I enjoyed it a lot.